So much fun. This place is great. I wish you could be down here because the weather could not be better. Not too hot and it's just warm enough. Monica is joining us to talk about all the neat things that we can find here at Portland Cinco de Mayo Fiesta. So what do you have in your hand right here, Monica? Uh, this is a Katrina doll that's handmade out of corn husk and uh, this is a, a traditional um, representation of the famous uh, holiday of Dia de Muertos which is seen in the movies like Coco and all that. And it's actually a very respected um, holiday where, in Mexico where um, uh, ancestors are celebrated even after their death. Yeah. I, I like the idea of that. It's um, a way to kind of br bring relief after such loss. And this is a great way to celebrate, certainly. The, the, the handcraft that goes behind this, um, we're at the booth of one of the finest artists here. Can you tell me a little bit about him? Yeah, so uh, right behind us is Mariano Palacios. Um, he is the head of uh, an artist collective of about 33 people. And we are lucky enough to have about 11 of those artists travel here from uh, Tonala, um, from Guadalajara and Tlaquepaque, which are kind of artist towns around the Guadalajara area. And they each have their own kind of special craft. And Mariano actually painted um, these huge facades that are above the booth here and uh, all, all by hand. That's something